lights before Christmas here on WTOL 11. We just lit that Norway spruce just a few minutes ago, and you can see there's all kinds of colors and designs this year. It's almost like it's animated this year, right? I mean, before we had a lot of movement as far as those lights are concerned, and I think one of the big attractions was the dancing light displays all across the zoo. However, this year, I think that tree is really going to grab a lot yeah, of attention. Yeah, they really amped it up this year. I mean, there's going to be so many different pictures. There's so many different <laughs> backgrounds of the tree. You've got candy canes, all blue, all purple. It's yep. really cool. Hey, there's plenty to do and see here at the Toledo Zoo during these next few weeks. But you know what, Melissa? There's also plenty to eat and drink. The Toledo Zoo draws you in with hundreds of thousands of lights, and they hope to keep you full and happy with some holiday eats. The foodies who come up with the menu say they consider the weather and the event when deciding what would be best for the guests. We wanted to keep things, you know, a lot of handheld, also warming items, you know, it's cold, so the chili, warm soup, warm sausages, everybody loves that kind of stuff. The zoo will once again feature pulled pork sliders and buffalo chicken egg rolls, along with their house-made and fried chips that you can upgrade as you see fit. The normal natural would be a natural chip, but we did went different and we did potato chips. So we deep fry our chips. You can have them plain, just salted, or like this is here, you can have them loaded. If you don't want jalapenos, say you don't want jalapenos. We're here to make everybody happy. The holidays are a time to indulge and the zoo is more than happy to help. They will once again be making fresh fudge, giant cookies and other sweets. And of course, they will have their hot chocolate done classic for kids or with a shot of alcohol for the adults. I personally love the loaded hot chocolate and you can also get them without alcohol as well for the kids. <laughs> now. We just touched on something in that story that you brought up earlier. You said sometimes the wear and tear of bringing the kids, getting them all bundled up and bringing them out here. Mom and dad might have want to have a little treat. Some of the things we like to do <laughs> to make memories as families aren't the most relaxing. We get that. Yeah. So the Toledo Zoo's got you covered out yeah. here. Treats for mom and dad, treats for the kids as well. And something they added a few years ago 